This is a two and a half minute video showing how to use the PC migration feature in VMware Fusion. This feature lets you copy the entire contents of a Windows computer over to a virtual computer running on your Apple um, operating system. And to get the process started, once you have VMware Fusion installed, you just choose Migrate Your PC from the File menu. This will start the step-by-step -step process that guides you through making all of this work. So you can just read the screens and click OK. At some point you'll be prompted to go to a website, a uh, web page on your Windows computer. That web page is vmware.com forward slash go forward slash PC to Mac. And when you do that, you won't really bring up a web page. You'll just start downloading the file that uh, comes from that web address. So you can save that downloaded file to your Windows computer. And once it's downloaded, go ahead and double click to run it and that'll install the PC Migration Agent, as you can see here. And you can just click through the default settings, should be fine for that. So this PC Migration Agent basically allows the Windows computer to communicate with the VMware on your Mac and then transfer the operating system, programs, settings, and all your files. So you just keep stepping through this process, accepting the default settings. And at some point, you'll be given a number that is a unique number for your Windows machine to communicate with the VMware running on the Mac. So you enter that number in on VMware to allow the two to communicate and then continue stepping through this process. Uh, the next screen will want you to provide your administrator username and password for the Windows computer and then VMware will create a directory where it's going to put all those files. Uh, actually a single file that's a virtual machine and you'll need to provide your username and password for the Apple computer as well to get this process started. And after a long period of time where it says it's migrating your PC, it'll eventually, if you're running Lion on the Apple, you'll get an error that says it can't create this directory. And it's really kind of unfortunate because there's no indication at the outset that you're going to have any trouble with this. And the migration assistant itself within VMware should immediately just bring up a red flag and say, hey, by the way, we notice you're running Lion. This doesn't work on Lion. Um, but unfortunately, it doesn't. It doesn't really explain that. But if you have uh, another operating system on your Apple computer, it'll work great and transfer everything over. So it's a real time saver. This has been a production of resourcesforlife.com.